we did not record and I did not feel like dubbing over previous video so I've made this video again so yeah I'm just gonna close that little window there and let's get started so there's this new game well not new it hasn't even come out yet steampunk airship game that I was just I got accepted into the closed beta which is amazing and I was just playing it and that's not part of it that's building it but it's very fun it's a steampunk airship and then I also saw the video building contest, which you can look back on our channel and find. There's not too many videos and not too many views because we're not cool. But, um, so I made my own airship. And I actually already toured through it, so it's going to get a bit boring. I mean, I missed some stuff. But as I said before, I did. I, the QuickTime did not record my audio. And it's also going to be a bit laggy because QuickTime is not good. But I'm still going to just look through it. So I made two from the big of this, because I had to do some TNT testing, and I didn't want to blow up my beautiful architecture, and I wanted to have, like, a backup. So, yeah, as you can see, I'm playing on a Mac. But, here's my beautiful airship. I'm going to do some cinematic -y stuff. This is all feels like deja vu to me, because I already made this video. But, it's kind of cool. It's very symmetrical, but also very disorganized. Because Guns of Icarus, just check it out. It's post-apocalyptic airship battles. And there's different weapons and guns and stuff you can put on your airship. And I'll explore all the parts later. In the last video, I had to, um, I mean, and there's some TNT cannon in the upper decks. So let's just start up here, I guess. So here's, like, these arrow shooters. They shoot arrows. Dispensers, but, you know, in Guns of Icarus, they have, like, machine guns. So I figured that do, but... You know, I didn't have much space to work with. If I did have more space, I would build with, like, repeaters and stuff. Now, these are fire charge launchers. And that just shot out cobwebs because I put cobwebs. So I put cobwebs in. But hold a sec, gotta pause. Okay. I'm back. So, I'm back. And I'm going to go back to touring. There's some slight technical difficulties. Something wasn't working with the video recorder and stuff. But here we go, back to these shoot fire charges. So I think I was just reviewing the nade launchers, all that stuff. This is kind of half a promotional video for Guns of Icarus. I'll probably post it on their Facebook wall or something. So everyone can think I'm a weirdo. But here is this, the rear engines. And you can do like this lever, like moves the pistons. And I have headphones on, so you won't hear any Minecraft sound, because I have my sound way up. So only I can hear them. Hamohaha. This is the cargo bay. It has, like, all this very small amounts of stuff, because it's post-apocalyptic, and there isn't much stuff really to have. As you notice, there are a lot of fences, and I kind of use fences like ropes and thin stuff, because not all airships are really fully solid. There's going to be, like, holes and stuff you can fall through. And it's not really that safe either. So I use nether brick fences here because they look cool. So I'm under the decks and there's the bed. Which is, there's one bed for the whole crew. <laughs> I just take turns sleeping. But, so that's below decks. And up here is like some main weaponry. And here's where the pilot's supposed to go. And if I had the Zeppelin mod, I'd put the controller brick here. But I have a Mac, so I can't do that. Stupid, stupid. Me. Well, actually, I technically could, but I'm too lazy to make my loader work. So, yeah. Of course, if I had a lot of viewers, I could be like, one of you help me. But I don't. We don't. We're not cool. So, yeah. That, that's that's what it is. As a, so, yeah, I'm probably going to miss some stuff because I'm redoing this. So I'm just going to walk around the airship a bit, show you some stuff. Um, I can't wait till 1.3 comes out because then we can have same color stairs and I won't keep on hating this step right here. I hate you. I hate you. I'm sorry, talking to the step. I'm weird. Okay. So this lever... Actually, none of this stuff here on the captain's thing does anything except for this lever. Because this shoots the TNT. The button technically would do something, but that would just glitch out my cannon. And I say my cannon because I designed it, I built it, and I actually have a video about it. So check out the rest of the channel. Look for Daedalus' TNT cannon. Spell with a 3 and a 4 because I'm so pro. It's like... So this is the main riggings. I made it, I tried to make it more ship-like, as in the riggings are sophisticated and crazy. And later on, I'll shoot the TNT cannon. 
So I lit this place up because mobs were spawning and blowing up my beautiful balloon, which spent so long to build without world edit. And basically, if I had world edit again, I'd probably copy this thing and build more of them and have like a giant airship battle and blow them all up. Oh, almost sunset. So that can be a chance to show my little tail light, which you can turn on, which I think is cool. This is one of the cooler additions of the game, the lamps. And this is just a little front gun. This is meant for the scout. And you can like walk across the balloon and fall off the balloon and be cool like that and be like, I'm the king of the world! Woo woo! Okay, totally making Titanic reference even though I didn't see the movie. So I'm so cool. Here's me on my airship. So beautiful. Okay, back back to the filming, Lucas, you're an idiot. Um, so there's the tail light, I'm gonna turn that on for the night. And then I'm gonna drop back down through the airship. Who needs ladders when you have safety rats? So, who cares? I'm just going to fall down onto my engine and show you the cruise bed. And that lever looks rather wrong there. I should probably texture it as something something inappropriate. But I don't go into it because I'm a nice person. So as you can see, it's still there. Sneaky. So here we have me climbing up. And now I am made it day again because I wanted to show you the TNT cannon, which... I probably is pretty cool. So here you go. See, it shoots TNT up and over. It's good for shooting, like, airships higher than you. And if I had the Zeppelin mod, this whole thing would be amazing. You just have, I just clone it and clone it and clone it on World Edit, and then I turn on the Zeppelin mod and make a beautiful, beautiful battle. And invite all my friends, I'd make it a server map on some server, and we'd have a giant Zeppelin battle, and I'd make a video, and we'd get a million views and be popular, but that's just me dreaming. So yeah, that's really, that's it. Okay? See you all next time, I guess.